My name is Mrs. Tawil, and I'm the art teacher at Firelands High School. Welcome to the art department. Allow me a moment to introduce myself. I earned my BFA degree from Bowling Green State University, specializing in two-dimensional art. I love watercolor, printmaking, and photography, and can't wait to share my work with you. I'm an art history nerd and studied abroad in Italy following that passion. I started teaching in Firelands in 1996 at the elementary schools. I earned my master's in education from Ashland University before spending four years teaching art at SAMS. I know that basement art room. I came to the high school in 2002, the same year I earned national board certification, where I started the first chapter of the National Art Honor Society in Lorain County in 2003. Some of my favorite processes to teach are oil painting, screen printing, copper enameling, raccoon fired ceramics, sewing machine work, and of course the stained glass window mosaics. I love teaching art because I get to use my whole brain and love to help students to do the same. The nine courses I'll be teaching at FHS this year are Art 1, 2, 3, 4, and AP Art and Design, which are all full year courses. I also offer four semester courses. Three are in person, Art Fundamentals, Art Appreciation, and Art History. And one is online, the online portfolio. Art Appreciation and Art History are offered next semester. While all of the other courses are hands-on art making studios, these two particular courses are non-studio, lecture, and media deep dives into the world of art that involve a textbook, reading, listening, and writing. Now, let me introduce the art room. The art room is in the heart of the freshman hallway, room 104. The first unusual thing you might notice is that there are two doors to the art room. The south door is the entrance, and the north door is the exit this year. You also might notice that this room has counter height tables, which many students enjoy for taking a standing break while working, especially for 90 minute blocks. Use the book deck at your feet to store your backpacks to maximize your workspace. There are sinks, ceiling fans, and plenty of outlets. There are even two kiln in the storage room. It's a pretty great space that is flooded with morning sunlight and a view of the inner courtyard. It's also one of the warmest rooms in the winter. Because there are no shared supplies between students and classes, art students are issued art kits for projects for the class. The contents of these kits vary by course and may include sketchbooks, charcoal, pencils, markers, paints, and canvases, among other materials. Take care of your materials. I won't have replacements for you. There are also supplies you are responsible for providing. This list has been published in the Firelands Express, posted in the Firelands blog, and in your Google Classroom. All studio classes will work with drawing materials, ink, paint, and clay. Expect to get your hands dirty. Be okay with getting paint or ink on your clothes or add your own apron to your daily art kit. There is a weekly sketchbook assignment for Art 1 through 4 and AP students. Art Fundamentals does not have a sketchbook to keep. You are expected to be prepared with your art materials each day because 90 minutes is a long time to do nothing because you didn't bring your materials. I have distributed all of the supplies to students and will have no spare supplies to loan. With only four class periods per day, you can do it. I believe in you.
I will announce and or post in Google Classroom what particular supplies may be needed ahead of time. I'm excited about conducting demonstrations at my desk this year to project on the big screen and to record and post for your reference. All art courses have a Google Classroom. I love Google Classroom. I post timely and urgent messages in the stream and post assignments and relevant materials, including those demonstration videos in the classwork area. This is where all assignments will be posted and turned in. You will turn in finished assignments via photographs uploaded to the assignment portal. You can use your phone, a digital camera, and even your Chromebook to take photos of your finished work for me to grade. Don't worry, I'll show you how to do this in class. Be sure to download the Google Classroom app to your phone if you haven't already and set up notifications for new posts. I'm excited to welcome you and can't wait to get to know you and your art. Outside of in-person class contact, email is the most efficient way to communicate with me. Please get in touch with any concerns or ideas. Together, we can make this space our own hive of creativity and this year unforgettable. Walk through this door ready to make the day count.